call hello, Yahweh Bashim, Yahweh Shai, you know, and bring it forth another article with respect to observing the times. Uh, this one is titled, California makes it illegal for parents to make medical decisions. Now, that is, that is a big fucking alarm. Okay, why? Because it's in the parents' interest. The child's well-being, okay, is supposed to be in the parents' interest. The parents should know what's best for the child. The parent has uh, their own, you know, belief system. You know, every people has a, their own belief system, etc. Um, you know, and there's just certain things that, uh, that's that, you know, but fuck the different belief systems. You know, let's just talk about just wanting to be healthy. First and foremost, you can't trust the medical mafia. You can't trust the government. You, you can't trust the government, you know. You can't trust the uh, uh, Salaki. You can't trust the government. You can't trust uh, these doctors to make the best decision possible for your children. They're just gonna prescribe. Uh, uh, they're gonna prescribe pharmaceutical drugs, uh, synthetic bullshit, okay? And uh, uh, because that's what they're that's what they're trained to do. You know, they're not gonna they're not gonna give you anything natural. They're not gonna give you anything beneficial to your health. Everything they are uh, in, conf they are uh, uh, in league with one another. Okay, they are in league with one another to keep their cash flow coming in. Okay, in their system that they set up. Okay, which is a huge system of of, of deception. Okay, so if if you know if you're like a person like myself and my brothers, we don't fuck with doctors at all. Okay. We got healers amongst us. The Lord guides us and teaches us to heal. You know, through the spirit of Yahweh Bashim, Yahweh Shai, we heal. You know, the Lord heals us. The Lord gives us knowledge with the herbs and then the oils and, and, and the fruits and the veggies. You know? And, you know, those that have that knowledge, you know, do their best to pass it on to their kids. You know, but then if you got the government making it illegal for parents to make medical decisions, right? And we decide, uh, 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 fuck antibiotics. Go with some natural antibiotics. Like, I was raised on natural antibiotics. I was never prescribed antibiotics growing up. My grandmother made natural antibiotics in the kitchen. Okay? From knowledge that was passed down from her uh, uh, father. Alright? You know, and, uh, uh, let me read a little bit of the article. Okay? It says uh, the new SB 18 bill will allow the state the state to seize children away from their parents and their homes if parents make medical decisions that the state deems not to be in the child's best interest. OK, uh, Dr. Richard Pan, the man behind the current mandatory vaccination law, SB 277, is behind this new bill, which will take which takes away yet more power from parents. That shit is dangerous. Why? Because you also got the Mark of the Beast uh, scenario happening, right? And uh, I had brought you out that, I think it was last week or the week before, uh, the article on um, on the uh, people being chipped that have mental disabilities. So if the government says, yeah, declares you were a mental disability and you got to get chipped, okay? And that's the new law and shit, uh, uh... You know that's that's like a uh, uh, in 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 a uh, a path to force that upon the people. So if you have this bill right here, uh, making it illegal for parents to make their own decisions, and the doctor for whatever reason, yeah, your 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 son, your daughter, they gotta get, they have uh, I declare them with this bullshit uh, 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 diagnosis, they need to get chipped. So just because he says he needs to get chipped, he's given that authority, then that kids is gonna get chipped. You know, it's just, you know, excuses to force shit upon us and the people accept it. it there's, no, there's not a lot of commotion. You know, the laws get passed. All these laws, these laws be getting passed around the fucking holidays, uh, uh, Super Bowls and shit like that. You know, uh, uh, big events that distract people usually be the holidays, Super Bowl, you know, and things like that. Holidays usually, you know, and, 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 and uh, uh, holidays and events, you know. Entertainment events And they always do the same shit Every single time Let me read a little bit more It says Which is what the, the same shit that they do 
is uh they uh 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 sneakily pass uh their bills and their laws okay uh while the people are distracted which is what they want they don't want you to know what they're doing okay then it's too late then you got to submit and you all and then they got you by the balls cuz you're scared to go to jail or die or all this all the fucking bullshit it says Dr. Pan's seven point list of rights declares that all children and youth have a right to have parents, guardians, or caregivers who act in their best interest and to form healthy attachments with adults responsible for their care and well being. It also stipulates that the child is to live in a safe and healthy environment and benefit from having social and, and emotional well being and to have opportunities to attain optimal cognitive, physical, and social development. The child should also have the appropriate quality education and life skills leading to self-sufficiency in adulthood and to have appropriate quality health care. However, critics claim this sets a dangerous precedent that spells the end of parental rights whenever a government official or agency declares so. Okay. Uh, further, the legislator's intent, okay, to establish a comprehensive framework that governs the rights of all children and youth in California, okay? Uh, now, that's California, all right? And, and like, I, like, you know, like it was said, you know, as it should be, you know, parents, guardians, caregivers who act in their best interest, you know, they're supposed to know what's best for their child. If you have a, uh, if you have a person, you know, that is of a sound mind, like take for, uh, for example, us men and women that's trying to follow the law, statutes, and commandments, you know, the ways of Yahweh Bashim, Yahweh Shai, to the best of our ability, you know, we ain't trying to be getting unnecessary surgeries, taking these drugs, you know, or this damn sorcery, you know, uh, uh, definitely no microchip, hell no, you know, so a lot of us is going to have to suffer, you know what I'm saying, might have to, some of us might get a kiss taken away from us. You know, Lord willing, not nah, some of us. I mean, hey, it's you know everybody's gonna have to face their own judgment and salvation. You know, but um, you know those that for whose salvation is for, and those for whom judgment is for, everyone is gonna have to face their own fate. But kids might get taken away. You might end up in jail. You might die. You know, because it's gonna get to the point where you know dare you raise your lip and say I ain't taking that vaccine. I ain't taking that shit. That's what it is. That's what's coming. Okay, so now it's gonna. Now this is just California, but who's the fucks to say that it won't spread to other states? You know, if if a uh, 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 a goddamn doctor, man, a goddamn doctor that is trained, you know, to is basically a fucking warlock and is trained to give a sorcery. All right, is being given the power. Okay, to declare that your child needs this, this, and that, and you can't do a goddamn thing. That's why we need to get the fuck out of here, man. You know, air ain't illegal, but the way these goddamn devils is going, it's going to be illegal. We're going to have to pay taxes soon just for every fart we throw. You farted, you burped, you know what I'm saying? Money out of our paycheck. Uh, 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 <laughs> you know, I don't know, man. It's just, it's just fucking ridiculous, but, you know, uh, that's what's going on. You know, that's what's going on, you know, and a lot of children are going to suffer. You know, a lot of more judgment is coming, is headed this way, you know, and as uh, as shit really gets tough, as food gets scarce, you know, as laws get tough, as these devils squeeze more and more, and uh, they censor more and more, and they make their moves on us, you know, shit is just going to get tighter, man, but, you know, hold fast to the faith. All right, call hello, Yahweh Ba'ashim, Yahweh Shai, to the house of David that shall be risen up. All right, stay strong. Shalom.